Hello student welcome to Max Study official YouTube channel in this video we are going to see about the DFCCIL cutoff marks based on 2018 and what was the number of candidate who is attempt the total number of question and based on that data we have analyzed and come up with the new cutoff and uh, all those details which is required for the student for the going with the further round we will discuss in this video so you need to stay at the end of the video if you have any type of query do mention in comment box so let's begin with the video So as you are aware of that DFCCIL has already released this vacancy for the 2021 so they, and as per the notification earlier they have also recruited in 2018 for the executive and operation post of station master so based on that data we have come up with the 2021 cut off marks so let's uh, go with the 2018 vacancies for the 2018 ex executive or operating and controller the pay was around 12600 that is the basic pay and uh, total number of posts was 109 in that 53 for unreserved 18 for sc st for 9 and obc for 29 and exactly same criteria is applicable for this year and uh, the based there there was a cbt test for uh, that for 2018 uh, vacancies similarly for 2021 as well and the cut off for the 2018 was examination held on 10th of uh, november 2018 application uh, registered with the 46472 and the number of candidate who is appear that examination only 26603 and the highest marks scored uh, by the candidate for unreserved category was 98.75 and for the lowest marks was 73.50 and for the sc 77.25 highest marks minimum marks was 63.75 and for the st 77.25 and the lowest marks was 63.75 and for the st 72.50 was the highest marks and 62.25 was the lowest marks for the obc 85.75 highest marks and lowest marks was 68.75 for the ex serviceman 82.5 and for the lowest marks for the ex serviceman was 51.75 these data are collected from the official website which is in the year of 2018 going ahead with the this year exactly same pattern of examination 2021 as well so if you check with the any of the post like junior manager and operation and bd their total part 1 part 2 two parts are there in that part 1 consist of 24 question part 2 consist of 96 question part 1 consist of the like general knowledge awareness reasoning and general aptitude and for for the part 2 they have related to the common subject of material management function behavior management of human resource finance and all like the common subject which are available as the notification they have mentioned over here similarly for the executive civil electrical and mechanical and signal and telecommunication as well so uh, as of now for the this year they have uh, mentioned the syllabus criteria for the junior manager civil you need to first appear with the cbt and there is no cbat process are there like computer based aptitude test there is no process for the junior manager civil but you need to have a document verification interview and medical test similarly for the junior manager operation and bd you need to have come up with a cbt uh, there is no cbat for the different uh, post like junior manager civil junior manager operation bd junior manager elect uh, electrical civil and mechanical there is no computer based aptitude test as per the notification but other than that all the things like document verification interview and medical test are there only for the executive civil and executive electrical there is no interview process going ahead with electrical signal and telecommunication similarly there is no cbat process for that for the uh, for the executive in a signal and telecommunication for the executive in operation bd and the mechanical for the operation bd you need to come with the, all the process there is no interview other than that, other than that all the things you need to go with that for the executive and mechanical you do you need to go with the examination aptitude test but there is no cbat for the mechanical engineering and there is no for uh, like process of interview in your category as well other than that for the junior executive operation in bd similar thing there is no interview and there is no cbat examination like computer based aptitude test for the junior executive in operation and bd as well 
so all the other posts which i have explained shortly you need to just uh, pause the video and check whether uh, which post you have applied and what was the process of uh, selection for that particular category so i'll just move with the uh, ahead so for the post of executive operation and bd total vacancy was 237 and reserve was 96 sc was 36 st 17 obc ncl was 65 and ews 23 and based on a uh, like reservation of handicap they have also provided certain seats you need to just refer based on a uh, process which they have mentioned in a notification so for the post of operation bd in executive category there are the examination held which is uh, 27 to 30th of september in that we have observed that gq question was 12 reasoning was 18 numerical ability was 12 science was 18 and for the part 2 there are total 60 questions in this the person who is scored in a gk 12 minimum you need to at least score with the 8 marks with the right options nothing uh, like you need to if you have attempt the wrong answer then un- unnecessary you are having a loss of that so you need to minimum maintain that marks for the reasoning there are total 18 questions in that minimum you need to secure with the 14 which uh, having a borderline of qualifying the next round for the similarly for the numerical ability out of 12 question you need to have with the 10 question which is very easy for the uh, engineers for the going ahead with the science there are total 18 question in that you need to uh, at least cover with the 13 question with the right options uh, similarly for the part 2 of a uh, different discipline they have uh, 60 question in mini- minimum you need to score with the 40 we have considered the minimum score based on the data which i have received from the student and the total number of uh, qu- questions was uh total number of marks for was was 120 and if you secure with the 85 marks this is a good for a student who is going to shortlist for the next round so as per the data which i have received from the student based on that we have uh, make a like range of uh, cut off marks for the post of executive and operation bd so the general category which have scored around 80 to 86 marks definitely start with the next round for the similarly for the obc 78 to 82 S- sc for the 71 to 74 st was 68 to 70 and ews was 76 to 80 marks so this is the on an average criteria of distribution of marks based on the student as well as from the based on the data which is available for the 2018 marks going ahead with the junior executive for the operation in bd total vacancy was 225 in that 90 for the reserve category sc for the 34 st was 17 obc ncl was 61 and ews for 23 for the reservation of handicap they have already mentioned in the advertisement based on the criteria you need to just take uh, which category you are lying from that particular cast so for the for the post of a junior executive in operation and bd the total question was 120 and based on that you need to uh, come up with the total uh, marks that is for the gk was 12 reasoning was 12 and uh, aptitude was 24 and railway uh, for basic knowledge of railways which they have asked related to current affairs was 24 and economics was 12 crm was 12 and science was 24 and uh, at least you need to score these marks which i have put it over here and if you lie more than 85 marks in that uh, in that paper then you are prepare for the next round based on that data we have calculated the cut off marks for the junior executive operation in bd so for the post of a general category at least you need to score with 83 to 87 marks for the obc 80 to 84 marks for the sc you need to score with the 74 to 77 marks for the st 70 to 73 marks and for the ews you need to at least score with the 81 to 85 marks so if you have any type of doubt related to this uh, videos or any other videos do mention in comment box if you like our videos definitely subscribe to our channel thanks for watching